Hello, my name is Dwight. I'm with Jewish Voice Ministries International. Today we are going to talk about the three different shofars that we provide through our ministry here. The first one is a ram's horn shofar. This would be the most typical, the most uh, traditional of the shofars. All of the animals that we get the shofars from are from the Holy Land or uh, Northern Africa. But the ram's horn is a smaller uh, shofar, but it still sounds good and it's still widely used. The next one that we offer would be one of an oryx. This is also from an animal from the same region, but it's a lot bigger, uh, a lot longer, skinnier, but it still works just fine. The last one, and my personal favorite, is from the kudu, or some people call it the greater kudu. Uh, this is my favorite because they have different pitches according to the different size of the horn itself. So you can, it's easier to play along with praise and worship and uh, have the right pitch so it, it flows well. For me, this is also easier to blow the kudu horn. As for how to blow the shofar, it is very similar to a trumpet. You just put your lips together gently and you blow and you have to have a vibration of your lips. You can't just blow and ex expect a sound to come out. It's very much similar to a, uh, a brass instrument or a, a trumpet. And now I would like to actually blow them so you can hear the sound of each of the shofars. The first one is the ram's horn. The second one is the oryx. And the third one is the horn from the kudu. And those are the sounds of the shofars. Thank you very much.